papyrus. From this plant, the ancient Egyptians had invented papyrus papers more than 5,000 years. The ancient name of this plant was Badi Ra, which means the gift of Ra, Sangat. That's why it was a holy plant in ancient times. For making paper is only this part. This plant originally 3 meters high, so it's about to make any size like large, medium, or small. For example, we're gonna take a little part. Then we remove the green cover because we need the inner white part for making paper. The ancients had used the outer part as well for making baskets, heads, mats, handles, because they found it flexible and very strong. Then we cut the inner part of the penis slices. But you'll find it fragile and friendly. That's why it has too much blood culture, sugar, and papers. So that we have to roll it up to get the work right and to make it more soft. And you can see the natural to get the slices. But it still has the sugar. To reduce the amount of sugar, we soaked in water for a week. A week in water, we get light paper like this. But if you want to have it, bright paper, dark paper like this, we soaked in water for two weeks. Longer water, darker it gets. Then we arrange the slices between two sheets. You understand my English or not? Yes. Very good. Yeah. Very good. Thanks. So then we arrange the slices between two sheets. Purpose in two directions, one horizontal and the other vertical. Horizontal and vertical layers. Till we finish the sheet of paper, we cover it by the other piece. Then we press it for another week. A week under the press and the slices will stick together naturally without any chemicals, without any glue, only because of the natural sugar and pressing. Of course, the ancients had uh, this machine so they used the rocks, let's do instead of this. The final result is getting a sheet of paper just like this one right here. You see it's a very strong paper, it's very flexible. It looks like the same paper was made by the ancient Egyptians.